You are spirit and soul. Stop saying you was born. You wasn't born shit. Actually, you were born, but you wasn't born here, motherfucker. You, if you have carbon in your skin, you was born in, on Xylanthia. When Source created my soul, it created your soul. That's the true definition of a soulmate. The souls that were created when, by Source together, and then they were split in half. They go different ways throughout the universe. All right? And then you go through different lifetimes and realities and planets as a soul. And then eventually you might land on this planet. And then your other half might land on this planet. And then y'all are magnetized and run across each other. And when y'all do, guess what that's called? Love at first sight. And shit like that. And soulmate. Right? But a soulmate has to be the opposite sex of you. It's duality. So if you're masculine energy, your soulmate is feminine energy. If you're fully feminine energy, your soulmate is masculine energy. That's a soulmate. But then you have a twin flame. Your twin flame is, is every single individual that was there when Source gave you your spark. So what's the spark? Every soul has a spark. So for you, you know how the soul has life. It travels. That's the spark. Okay. Every soul received. Now this is true, deep, divine, esoteric downloads right now. You can't find this shit in the book if you wanted to. Because they can't tell you about the shit because these human beings wasn't even there, there in the beginning. They just got here 6,000 years ago. So at the end of the day, if and it wasn't even a full 6,000. But in the beginning, when Source created our souls, each soul received a spark. Hear me clearly. Screen recorded, shared the TikTok, the whole nine. So you can understand how what a soul, how it even gets its energy. In the beginning, a soul received this spark. When I was when my soul was receiving my spark, from where? The eternal flame. So you have an eternal flame in the cosmos. And it gives each, it is its responsibility is to give each soul its spark. Once the soul gets its spark, then it can actually go experience different lifetimes. So that means if your soul never got its spark, you couldn't even come land down here. You get what I'm saying? You couldn't even come on this planet and land here. So you have to get your spark first. So now when you get in your spark, it comes from the eternal flame. What color is the eternal flame? It's the blue flame. This is where the kundalini energy that's within us comes from. Kundalini energy, if you know exactly what it is, it sits down there by your kunda gland or by your anus. Okay? The kundalini energy is an actual gland inside of you called the kunda gland. It's down there by your motherfucking anus or asshole. Not to sound asinine right now. You get what I'm saying? But this kunda gland releases this blue flame. This blue flame comes from the eternal flame that you received when your soul was first created. So that would that would thousand lifetimes ago because this ain't your first lifetime this is just your first experience okay so if you look at any fire it received the fire that we created receives its spark from the eternal flame this is what fire the element of fire was born out of the eternal flame so that spark that that eternal flame give out blue sparks why blue because the blue flame is the warmest part of the fire all right so that blue flame is inside of you, just like the rest of the cosmos and all of plant life. So that blue flame is inside of you. But guess what? That blue flame isn't just inside of you. It's inside of a, a million other souls that was created when you were, because it was a line for us to get our spark. So that means you got a trillion souls we lined up. Once they started, once the eternal flame started sparking me, it sparked you if you was right there with me. Now, if you was in that group of a thousand or a million or however many souls that was sparked at that time, Guess what y'all are going to have in common? Y'all will all be considered twin flames. This is the true meaning of a twin flame. This is why, so a twin flame is just a soul that received the spark when you received your spark. But a twin flame and a soulmate is two different things, okay? A soulmate is the soul that was created together with Source, and then yet the soul was split into, two, into a pair, and each pair was sent off. So when that so when the pairs were sent off into the galaxy to travel, each, each soul... Went to the eternal flame at its own time. So just because we soulmates don't mean we twin flames. You get it? And just because we twin flames don't mean we, we mean we soulmates. But if we twin flames, guess what? We're going to have a lot in common. When we get around each other, our energy going to mesh. All right? This is where you get your best friends from. This is where you get your homies from. This is where you get your, oh, that's my girlfriend, my home, my best friend's my girl, that's my girl. That's where you get that family member from that you really genuinely fuck with out of all your other family members because y'all got so much in common. That's because that's a twin flame. Y'all y'all souls were both received this spark by the eternal flame of the cosmos at the same time. So that's the true meaning of a twin flame. And a soulmate is the soul that was split in half, but it's, it's a part of you, it's your same pair. Whereas the twin flame, y'all just got the same spark. 
But the soulmate, that's the other half to you. That's your other half, literally. 